2018 VP1. An asteroid is headed our way, and according to some astronomers, it may cast a shadow on election day. Literally. Wait till you hear this. So, we should probably point out that the world won't end on this day, but it is a good distraction from the unbelievable year in question that we all won't forget in a hurry. 2020 sure has pushed us to the brink. As individuals, we are all struggling now with all sorts of problems brought about by the year's uncertainty, but fear not, it gets better in the future. The shadow banning on YouTube of the Lost History Channel means it's very difficult for us to be noticed and reach our viewers as we would like, but we keep going because we love creating content. Content such as bringing to the attention of our subscribers the presence of an asteroid known as 2018 VP1, but at only 7 feet in diameter, it won't do any damage at all. Instead, it will make for a spectacular fireball burning up into our atmosphere on November the 2nd, meaning it will probably be highly symbolic at this election. With odds of hitting Earth at 1 in 240, or 240 to 1 if you are a gambler, NASA's JPL have been quick of the mark to point out that it's impossible for an asteroid that size to do any damage at all to our planet suggesting by the time it reaches ground level it will be smaller than the size of a human hand or possibly completely disintegrated but the new york times do report their disappointment that it won't be hitting hard on august 16th asteroid 2020 qg passed less than 2,000 miles above our atmosphere and this was about 20 meters in diameter roughly the size of an suv with some astronomers discovering that asteroid just after its close passage making it the closest asteroid ever to pass at short a close distance without being detected. The election asteroid, however, was discovered in 2018 by astronomers using a robotic telescope facility on Palomar Mountain in California while on the lookout for dangerous space rocks, among other cosmic surprises. The object has not been seen since, which accounts for the uncertainty in its trajectory. NASA established its Near-Earth Object Observations Program in 1998 and has since discovered around 19,000 Near-Earth objects. Within the category of Near-Earth Objects, NASA is also tracking potentially hazardous objects and these asteroids, like the Apophis asteroid, which we will link our video below, are anywhere from 100 to 500 feet wide and are projected to come within 5 million miles of Earth. Fortunately, none of these asteroids is scheduled to visit anytime soon with the Apophis asteroid, the next main concern in 2036, but the 2029 close approach will tell us more. So even if the asteroid hits on November 2nd, it might give some stargazers a bit of a fireball vantage view, but nothing else. Just thought we'd let you guys know either way. Take care and we'll see you in our next video, which is coming up just shortly.